Welcome back to the Ghost Key. I am Grant. Today, we're still working on Team Rocket stuff. I know, we've just been doing this forever and ever and ever and ever and ever. And it just never ends. This is one of those things where I really wish, I'm starting to really wish, especially since I'm doing LPs and shit now, I really wish they would have, like, broken this, this stuff up a little bit. I mean, it's because it's a bit, it's a bit redundant. I used that word last episode, too. It's a bit redundant to kind of jump in and, and do all this Team Rocket stuff like it did in Mahogany, and then I have to turn around and do it all over again here in, in Goldenrod. But I, you know, I guess it is, I guess it is what it is, right? I mean, can't really, can't really change much about that. But anyhow, um, I've been thinking kind of while I've been, uh, I've been doing this stuff, and I'm thinking, I'm leaning towards doing some, uh, uh, whatever you want to call it, some Pokemon, uh, uh, ROM hacks and stuff while we do the, the, uh, I don't know, while we do Omega Ruby and stuff like that. Um, in anticipation of it and all that stuff, I, I am just gonna jump right in and, and do it and play the shit out of it and all that good stuff and, you know, hopefully with it being a new game and all that stuff, it'll bring some people to the channel and, and, and get ourselves and get our name and all that good shit out there, which would be great. Because, you know, what the hell else are we going to do, right? I mean, it's, you know, it's what everyone wants is, is subs and all that good shit. Anyhow, um, like I said, I may end up doing two Pokemon LPs at the same time. I am a little averse to doing that sort of thing because... I really, I really want this channel to have a bit more um, diversity. I mean, hence why I started with a couple of FPSs and stuff like that. Like I said, those have toned down for now, and I do have other things in the, in, you know, that I'm going to be doing here soon. Once things settle down here on my end, I've got a couple of other LPs that I do plan on doing and stuff like that. But I, you know, like I said, uh, since you know I've been playing Zeta in my own free time. With the girlfriend, you know, I've kind of taken a liking to that, and I'm kind of interested to see what else is out there in terms of ROM hacks and stuff. And I keep seeing a bunch of other ones all over YouTube and shit too, and you know, some that I've seen that are pretty interesting that I really want to get my hands on. Um, like I said, Omicron and Zeta are pretty cool, and and I recommend people going and finding those and playing those because they're awesome. But um, you know, that may be something that that I'll hold on to until you know hopefully that Ome hopefully when Omega Ruby brings some people to the channel you know have a have a voice of the viewers and, and you know figure out what you guys feel like you know having me play but you know regardless I am still gonna continue on with Gen 4 and ultimately Gen 5 and then Gen 6 after Omega Ruby um, just cuz that's just you know me indulging my my own little uh, I don't know my Whatever you want to call it. I, don't, I really don't know. Just indulging my own interests and all that shit like that. Because that's kind of what I want to do. Is just figure those out and, and do those. And hey, look at that, fucker. See? That wasn't so hard. I've seen people have all sorts of trouble with that shit. That wasn't that hard. No, I just randomly pressed buttons and magical things happened. Quite literally. That's exactly what I did. I was like, I don't know. Let's just try this one. Let's try that one. Let's try the other one. Fuck it, let's do this one instead. All right, hey, look at that, it worked. It's pretty much how my thought process goes when I'm playing games like this, seriously. I just fucking randomly click on things like, oh, look at that, shit worked, brain power. Didn't need to use any of it. We just save it all for putting together a good squad. And then once we figure that out, we're like, yeah, fuck it, we'll just coast to the rest of the game. This is pretty much how we, it's pretty much how I do this shit. I mean, you know, games are supposed to be fun, you know, they're not, they're not, they're not supposed to be, you know, that taxing. Although, I mean, truth be told, I am using, you know, analytical, I don't know, processes to actually go through a game like this, and it's something that I'm interested in, so it's not that, that taxing on the mind, you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't know what I'm fucking talking about either, honestly. I'm just fucking saying shit at this point. But that's pretty much every episode. But you should know that by now. Since we've got actually two LPs under our belt. If you include Enemy Front and... and Whatever the hell that other one was. Leaf Green. There we go. That's what it is. But I do plan on bringing back Fear. Don't, don't, don't forget about that. 
I know I've, I've said that before. It's it's coming back. It's not it's not on hold forever. I just got to figure out how shit's gonna break down, and then once things, once I get into a routine here in fall, and of course you know with Omega Ruby and stuff, you know we'll we'll get into it and start. Ooh, hello, hello guy. Oh god, oh god, you're not going any further. I don't show mercy to my enemies and stuff. What is in here? Seriously, does anyone fucking? <laughs> It's like it's just this is this is one of those times where like you're playing a game and quite honestly I put myself on autopilot. I do that a lot, by the way, and I just don't pay attention to shit. I mean, you know, you can call me dumb or whatever. You know, I just there's ooh that was actually I'm I'm impressed by how much rock smash did to that eradicate. I thought it'd bring it down to about half health. Shit, I'm okay with that. I'm I'm down on that. All right. You know, it's just. One of those things where you just kind of like, you just gotta push yourself through the freaking, you know, bullshit, I guess, and just suck it up and go through all this, you know, not really needless battles, but I mean, all this practice, is, I guess, is what what it is. You know, it's kind of like, it's kind of like, you ever taken like a math class and you gotta sit there and you just have to do all this work like you go to class and all you do is like copy you know problems that the teachers doing on the board that's pretty much what pieces of pieces like this in a pokemon game are to me you show up you're not really zoning in and really learning anything at least i don't you just sit there and go through the motions and write all whatever's on the fucking board you just write that shit down and you're like i'll figure it out later you know i mean that's how i do it i just kind of go through the motions and you know, I mean, I'm not gonna lie, I don't have any, any interest in math, and it's kind of boring to me, and I'm not any good at it, and my inability to focus, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, fine, fuck you guy, I'm gonna stand right here, hey oh, he says, you know, but that, like, cause, I mean, what are we really doing here, I mean, we're literally just going through, we're beating trainers after trainer after trainer, and they've all pretty much got the same Pokemon, so you're really not excited about, like, oh my god, look, it's something different, it's a Grimer, Team Rocket has pretty much nothing but poison types and Golbat. Oh, and, and Eradicate. Sorry. Sorry. Although, Golbat is part poison, right? Isn't he like poison flying or something like that? Or, I don't know. Something like that. But, I mean, you know, you're just kind of going through the motions, just trudging through it. You're not really paying attention. You're not really getting anything out of it. It's just... Time to level everybody up. Although I enjoy leveling people up, yes, and and it's much more exciting when you have someone who's like on the on the verge of learning something important, like Ice Beam with with Hellas a little bit ago. I mean, it's one of those things. Where it's like, okay, okay, okay. When are we gonna get it? When are we gonna get it? You know, shit like that. Or when stuff's close to evolving, like um, Cray Cray was earlier when Cray Cray was like, bam, I evolved, and you're like, oh shit, getting real now. But you know that's that's just that's just the way I feel about it. I mean, it's it's it really is one of the more boring parts of the game, in my honest opinion. But I think you do you do kind of see what LPs are, as I've said before, are really made of when it comes to battling. I mean, it's yeah, you know, it's one thing to be like super cautious and shit, you know, during during a boss fight. And I think I don't know, like I, I kind of take like a laid back approach to that i don't know if you noticed but like i don't hype up you know going to a gym and like yeah it's a gym battle yay and stuff and stuff but i mean for me it, it, it's just like I, I don't know maybe this is just me being me but to me it's just another battle like yep i got a gym battle it's not like oh my god i know how people like the dramatic effect of it and, and shit like that which which is cool I, I get that i mean i like sports too you know i mean i i get into the competition and i watch that stuff and, and and i and i get into that shit too but it's just for me as a participant it literally is you know it's just oh yeah we got morty today so we're just gonna go fucking kick his ass and you know beat him up that's pretty much pretty much my thought process going into stuff like that like this i mean i know there's a couple of what team rocket execs I don't think we fight Giovanni or anything here, or whoever, or anybody special. Because to me, it's just another battle. I mean, honestly, when we fought Dick earlier, I didn't even know Dick was there. I knew we fought him at some point, but I didn't know he was going to show up. It's like, oh, yeah, there's Dick. And we're going to beat him up. Take his money. Make him run around to the Poke Center and 
white out or black out or whatever the hell they call it anyway anymore but any, i mean i don't know that's just that's just me i mean I'm, maybe i'm just weird like that sleep talk you know i've never used that move i don't think i've ever used a move anything like that director who what you came to rescue me wait weren't you by the thing and didn't I? Oh wait, no, that was the fake director. Oh, look at that, I'm putting two and two together. I'm smart, I'm using my brains. That's right. Yeah, oh God, oh God, we're, we're stuck on things and stuff. All right, we got stairs here. Where do these stairs take us? Amulet coin, okay, all right. That's, that's interesting. Oh, look at this little, oh. Oh, oh yeah, you're one of the hey, yeah, you're one of the good guys, aren't you? I like you. I I like you. Give me the goodies. Give me. Oh yeah, isn't this like the warehouse or some shit where there's just a bunch of goodies laying around? Or or am I getting all like excited? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Move that shit. Yeah, fucking. Oh god, I want a machoke now. I really do. I want one. Move some shit for me, machoke. Yeah, they're all right. I don't, really don't use those much or anything, but anyhow, at least we're getting goodies. I like goodies. Who doesn't like goodies? Hey, hey, hey. Move that container. Give me more shits. You got a good good TM over here or something like that or freaking Rocky Helmet or some burnt heel. That's not really worth your Machoke's effort. I mean, I'm sorry. I'm not trying to be a dick, my friend, but, but uh, yeah, that's it's a bit disappointing. That's all there is to it. Uh, yeah. Oh, okay. This is, this is the, the, whatever the hell it is, the service counter maintenance. Yeah, yeah, this is the place with the tall buildings and the stuffs in it. And I'm getting out of here. Because that's just what we do. Anyhow, because it's, it's about time to end this episode. But anyhow, I mean, uh. Yeah, here, here we are. We are, I think, maybe next time, perhaps, perchance, we may in fact finish the Team Rocket shit for now. For now. But we'll see. We, we shall see, my young Padawans. That's right, I'm dropping some Star Wars slang on you and shit. Side note, I know way too much about Star Wars. And I knew a lot about Star Wars before it fucking became trendy. You know what I'm talking about. You know Star Wars become has become trendy the last, what, five, six years. All of a sudden everyone's like, oh, fucking Star Wars. Yeah, Star Wars is amazing. Stormtroopers and Darth Vader. Oh, Stormtrooper night. Yay. Yeah, no. Yeah. I, I was into that shit way, way before that became a thing. But anyhow... That's it for this episode. Thanks a lot for watching. And I don't know where I was going to go with that. Oh, 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 there we go. My brain worked now. I got a false started on that one. There we go. All right. You ready for it? Are you ready for it? All right. Ready? Three, two, one. You made it this far on YouTube. You know what to do. Thanks a lot for watching. And remember... The ghost key is the only place where pants are optional.